Would you purchase my magazine? Uh, yeah, I would. It's really realistic, and I love the picture on the front. It makes it look like a real music magazine. Also, how the masthead is actually behind the picture is quite conventional for a normal magazine. Uh, you've got one. Of, you've got good things like the free poster advertised, so draws the readers in. You've got plenty of pull lines all over there, and your skyline stands out quite well. So, yeah. Do you think my magazine okay. price is suitable? Yeah, three pound. I think that's a suitable price for a magazine, especially with sixty pages in it. I mean, a normal magazine has about ninety to one hundred pages in it, and it's about four pound. So, three pound. Yeah, plus three pound for a student is affordable, and like the four pound for a normal magazine, so that makes it more available to for these students to get, which is a wider audience. What encouraged you to buy my magazine? Um, one encouragement magazine would be probably the pull quotes, such as the Tomorrowland Festival, because who doesn't want to go there? Um, things like the double page spread, with lots of pull quotes in it. Uh, you've got the free poster, you can see what the posts offer and why they're offering it. And uh, there's just plenty of stuff to read in it, I guess, which seems quite interesting. Thank you. What did you like about my contents page? Um, the main thing I liked about the contents page is the fact that it actually looks like it's from a real magazine. For example, you've got all your storylines down the side, you've got your main image in the middle, just like a normal magazine would. You've got the uh, masthead at the top, which is conventional to the front, because it's continuity all the way through. And the fact there's a double page is quite unusual for a, mag uh, a contents page, but at the same time adds uniqueness to the magazine. What did you like about my contents page? Um, the main thing I liked about the contents page is the fact that it actually looks like it's from a real magazine. For example, you've got all your storylines down the side, you've got your main image in the middle, just like a normal magazine would. You've got the uh, masthead at the top, which is conventional to the front, because it's continuity all the way through. And the fact there's a double page is quite unusual for a, mag uh, a contents page, but at the same time it adds uniqueness to the magazine. What did you like most about the double page spread? Um, I love the continuity about how the same person is on the front cover and on the double page spread, because obviously that's what would be like a normal magazine if it's main story. Plus the pull quote, he died because of me, is really interesting because when I read on I understand why or how he died because of her. So it pulls you into the story and you actually want to read the article. Okay, does my you. magazine offer appropriate subjects for my genre? Uh, I think it does. The genre is pop and indie. And the magazine offers a lot of things such as festivals, uh, pop artists, the new incoming pop artists. And it gives away things like the free tickets to the festivals, just what people like indie and pop would like to see. So on the whole, I think, yeah. Thank you.